Good morning, everybody. How are you guys doing? Okay, so here's the deal. We're having like a, this today is, I don't know, you guys have to know, it's been trending for two days now. If you follow me on here, or you follow me on Twitter, or if you follow Shaq or Crypt, or if you follow anybody, you know about this ridiculous top 50 all-time best rapper list that Joe Button put together. If you want to know my actual real feelings about this list, uh, go to Twitter. <laughs> I tweeted it, but I'm not going to say it on here. But what I am going to do today is through the requests of my subscribers, whether they know it or not, they have requested different individuals off this list. And I believe that some of the individuals on this list deserve to be heard and tell Joe Button exactly how they feel about where they were placed on this list. Yes, it is a very creative and slightly sarcastic way of letting Joe Budden know how we feel about things. Started off is a request going off going out to Le is it Leon? Leon? You know what's interesting Leon is that my dad's name is Leon yet he spells it exactly like yours and people call him Leon all the time and he's like no dude it's Leon L-E-O-N. And they're like, yeah, but Leon is the same, spelled the exact same way. <laughs> Just pronounced differently. Yeah, it's Leon Anderson. And we're going to find out what the notorious B.I.G. Mr. Biggie Smalls. How does he feel about being placed number eight? on your list that is five slots below you joe we're gonna find out because mr leon anderson has requested machine gun funk from the notorious big let's get it
motherfuckers like Ike beat Tina. What's love got to do? When I'm ripping all through your whole crew, strapped like bamboo, but I don't swing guns. I got bags of funk and it's selling by the tons. Niggas wanna know how I live the mic life. Making money, smoking mics like crack pipes. It's type simple and plain to maintain. I add a little funk to the brain. The funk, baby. I'm viewers were actually alive when that song came out. I was... No. I know a lot of you were. And those of you who weren't, it's okay. It's okay because it means that you live vicariously through your parents. Which is great because that's how, how I learned to love music. And it's how I learned how to love probably about half the music that I love, or at least the type of music that I love. Um, it's definitely how I learned how to love rock and roll, was through my mom. We've talked about this. All right, that is, <laughs> that is the notorious B.I.G. Mr. Biggie Smalls letting us know how he feels at number eight. All right, all right, I'm done, I'm done, oh no. I'm not done with the list. I'm done now. I hope you guys enjoyed that. You guys have a wonderful, beautiful day. Smile. Make other people smile. Yes. Please comment, like, subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you know when I drop my next video. And what else? Damn straight. Take care of each other because no one else is going to. Ciao.